Hello, hello, hello. The next problem is a classical Newtonian mechanics problem. It's not quite a high school problem, but many of you in high school may be able to do this. It depends on your high school. For sure, this problem is well within reach of all first-year college students who take a course in physics. Here is a disc, a solid disc, which is touching the sidewalk right here. This is the ground, it's horizontal. And the whole idea is that I want to pull that disc so that it just starts to come off the ground. And I do that with a rope that is attached on this side of the disc and also on the back side of the discs. So there are really two ropes. But I will only represent here the sum of the two forces. The forces on both are the same, but the sum of those two forces with which I pull is this F. So the mass is 25 kilograms, the radius is 30 centimeters. We will use this for the gravitational acceleration. And so I am beginning to pull. This angle here is 30 degrees, that's a given. And I pull at an angle beta with the horizontal and I pull harder and harder and harder, and all of a sudden, ah, I see that the disc starts to come up, lose contact with the ground. First question. If beta is 20 degrees, what is then that force in Newtons, by the way, three-digit precision. That's the first question. Now, the second question I find more interesting. Clearly, that force at which the disc just begins to lift depends on beta. And so I want you to calculate at what value for beta that force would be a minimum. Again, yeah, the angle beta at which the force would be a minimum. And then I want to know what that minimum force then is. Again, in Newtons with three digit precision. All right. It's not very difficult. I would say. It's not very easy either. I expect many, many correct answers. Three answers. What is the force? Which is of course the sum of the two forces because I pull on both ropes but I call that the sum of those forces just this F. So what is that force in Newtons if the angle beta is 20 degrees? At what angle beta is the force a minimum? And what then is that minimum? Again, I want for the forces three digits precision in Newtons. Have a nice day, take care, and for sure we will be friends. That goes without saying. <laughs>